It is a push to fix a problem that Mayor Cooper says makes the cr uh, criminal justice system harder on the poor. We are talking about the fees and fines that add up quickly during the legal process. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb explains. The report from the Center for Justice and Safety Finance addressed the fines and fees usually charged in the justice system in Nashville, which the mayor's office says can disproportionately further punish low-income individuals. While the report pointed out some positives for Nashville, like eliminating a $44 a day jail fee for those arrested for misdemeanors, the group Free Hearts says the city should forgive jail fees that have already built up. They can make that 2018, you know, law, they can make it retroactive is what they can do. And that will go a long way with cutting fees. Free Hearts recently started up a fund in Nashville to pay fines and fees to help restore the voting rights of those who used to be in jail. The report suggests Metro Council could take further action by eliminating a $33 a month probation supervision fee charged to anyone the state oversees on probation. But Free Hearts says it's the accumulation of all kinds of fees that can take years to pay off. How about we get rid of the the, the um, fee for someone being on probation in criminal court? How about we get rid of the fee for someone that is on community corrections? Mayor Cooper's office says he looks forward to implementing more of the report's suggestions with Metro Council and the courts. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.